टूडे कॉन्सेप्ट इज टूडे कॉन्सेप्ट इज डायनेमिक हैंडलिंग फाइल सिस्टम वेरी वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट कॉन्सेप्ट एंड इजी कॉन्सेप्ट दर इज डायनेमिक हैंडलिंग फाइल सिस्टम डायनेमिक हैंडलिंग फाइल सिस्टम वेरी वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट कॉन्सेप्ट इजी कॉन्सेप्ट फ्लाट फाइल flat file is nothing but it doesn't have any free defined format it doesn't have any free defined format flat file is nothing but it doesn't have any free defined format that's why we are calling flat file for example notepad and text document there is no format there is no format whatever you want it can uh, we can write it whatever you want you can write it we can write characters we can in char we can uh, write special uh, special characters and uh, uh, numbers symbols whatever you want you can write it so that's why we are calling flat file flat file is nothing but it doesn't have any free defined format okay whatever you want you can write it that's why we are calling flat file okay right today concept is dynamic handling file system concept if you want to create a if you want create a new file in file system if you want create a new file in file system if you want write the data into the file system if you want write the data into the file system if you want read the data from file system if you want create a new file in file system if you want write the data into the file system if you want read the data from file system we will use file system concept we will use file system concept without going to d drive or e drive we can create the file we can create the file and we can write the data into the file and we can read the or get the data from file that's why we are using file system concept that purpose we are using file system concept to file system concept to if you want create a new file in file system if you want to write the data into the file system if you want to get the data from file system we will use file system concept it's very very important concept so for that we are using five free defined classes one is file second one is file writer third one is buffer writer file reader buffer reader okay we are using five free defined classes file file writer buffer writer file reader buffer reader okay file is used for create a new file in file system using file free defined class using file free defined class we can create the new file in file system file writer using file writer we can write the data into the file system sir what is buffer writer only if you write file writer it will not write the data into the file system compulsory we need to take the reference of buffer writer then only we can able to write the data into the file system okay just you need to remember only one thing if you write file writer we can't write the data into the file system compulsory we need to take the reference of buffer writer then only we can write the data into the file system so using this buffer reader reference we can write the data into the file system next file reader file reader is used for we can we can read the data from file system only if you write only file reader we can't read the data from the file system compulsory we need to take the reference of buffer reader then only we can 
read the data from file system we will use buffer reader reference and using that buffer reader reference we can get or we can read the data from file system so these are the using these using file free defined classes we can write the data into the file system first of all we can create the new file in file system and we can write the data into the file system we can get the data from file system for that we are using five free defined classes file file reader buffer reader file reader buffer reader so now i will explain you this concept that is dynamic handling file system concept it's very very important concept very very important concept to that is dynamic handling file system concept Yeah, today concept to dynamic handling file system concept to so go and take the new class that class name is file system No need to worry it's easy come easy concept we can complete Within minutes and taking one class observe class name is file don't take only file why because file is a free defined class if you take class name is under okay class name and this name is if it is same uh, java will feel confused just to take spell mistake i am taking file click on finish if you want to create a new file in file system simply we can write class name reference name equal new class name file f equal to new file file f equal to new file so class name reference name equal new class name now where you want give the path i want in d colon i want d colon so d colon and give the name hyderabad dot text txt text file import the statements file java ivo java ivo right okay if dot create new file if dot create new file so it will create the one file in file system in d colon it will create the file right next file writer fw equal to new file writer give the path Path is D colon HYD dot text. Only if you write file data, it will not write the data into the file system. Compulsor, we need to take the reference of buffer writer. Buffered. Writer BW equal to new buffered writer and we need to give the file writer reference FW. This is the only logic only for this logic we are learning this concept to file writer if double equal to new file writer and giving path only if you write file writer we can't write the data into the file system compulsory we need to take the reference of buffer writer buffer writer bw equal new buffer writer i'm using file writer reference only for this logic we are learning this concept if you want to write anything bw dot write bw dot write so whatever you want you can write here so hi hi good morning keep calling bw dot 
new line sorry sir hmm sir yeah ask me more ipudu additional end uh why we have taken it additional is that this buffered writer and edoksa cheptara endu chestunnaru only if i write a file writer it will not write the data into the uh, uh, data into the file system madam compulsor we need to take the reference of buffer writer then only we can able to write the data into the file system madam so only if you use file writer we can't write the data into the file system compulsory compulsory 100 100% we are take we need to take the reference of buffer writer then only we can write the data into the file system so that's why i'm using buffer writer bw means buffer writer reference dot write hi good morning bw dot new line i'm taking new line why because it will write continuously so i don't want so i want to next line so that's why i'm writing bw dot new line if you want write any bw dot write next message write bw dot write if you want write anything say i hate this monday i hate monday always not only today i hate i hate monday why we gas <laughs> tell me madam tell me everyone everyone not only me madam everyone hate monday why why madam is there any reason after weekend after weekend uh, after weekend uh, it will come and every hmm. monday they will conduct one meetings review meetings something something monday is very 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 crucial day for any employee so i hate monday i love saturday <laughs> Okay, right. We double that. I have right Monday. Andu. Uh, compulsory. We need to use flash. If you want to hold the data, if you want to hold the data, we will use B W dot flash. Flash is used for. Flash is used for. We can hold the data. We can hold the data. We can hold the data without using flash. It cannot hold the data. Okay, without using flash. we can hold the data we cannot hold the data only if you use flash we can hold the data yeah now yesterday we discussed which concept to exception handling right yes right we are just what is the what is exception handling mm 12 pm okay madam okay madam okay madam okay madam One o'clock, madam will come. Two o'clock. Okay, no problem. File writer. File writer. Where is file writer? Import statements. File writer. Go file writer. Java Ivo. File writer. Java Ivo. Go file writer. Java Ivo. Buffer writer. Java Ivo. Buffer writer. Buffered writer. Java Ivo. So after writing this code, it is showing some exceptions. It is showing underlines so that is called exceptions. So here we can use add throws. I have exception. It can. Already I told you throws is is for it can handle the all the throws at a time, all the exception at a time. See, so it is showing error. Just keep the cursor on underline. So it will show you add throws declaration. Click on enter. Enough. it can handle the hundreds of exceptions at a time so yesterday exception handling uh, we discussed one of the concept that is throws throws class is used for it can throws the all the exceptions at a time so here also here we can get number of throws number of exceptions 1 2 3 4 5 6 exceptions so at a time i want to throw so just to add throws declaration keep the cursor automatically it will show you so we can create the new file in file system and we can write the data into the file system compulsor we need to write the flash then only it can hold the data otherwise it cannot hold the data go so save click on run it will create file in d colon and it will write the data into the file system it will write the data into the particular file go to d and check it hyderabad where it is hyderabad where 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 where, where, where? Oh, hyderabad hi good morning i hate monday okay ma right if you are not writing flash observe carefully i am commenting the flash so it will not write the data into the file system it will not write the data into the file system go and check it go to hyderabad 
no data go no data so after writing the data compulsory we need to use flush okay so using file we can create the data into the, we can create the file into file system and we can write the data into the file system okay finished now i want to get the or read the data from file system i want to get the or read the data from file system so we will use file reader observe carefully file reader fr file reader fr equal to new file reader give the path give the path in d colon colon hash hyd dot text txt okay right i want to read the only if you write file reader it will not read the data from file system compulsor we need to take the reference of buffer reader buffered reader br equal to new buffer reader new buffer reader fr new buffer reader fr file reader fr equal file writer file reader fr equal new file reader and buffer reader br equal new buffer reader fr same logic same logic if you write only file reader it will not write the data into the file system compulsor we need to take the reference of buffer reader buffer reader br equal new buffer reader fr so next why we are using boolean tell me what is the use of boolean already i told you data types in data types i already told you what is the use of boolean true or false mm. now i want to check data is available or not okay using this boolean we can find out so data is available or not so i want to find out then next we can write boolean boolean okay chennai reference name i am <laughs> taking chennai boolean chennai equal to we are dot ready we are dot ready semicolon sysso control space chennai problem chennai people they are facing number of problems okay boolean chennai we are equal to ready system dot out dot printl and chennai so if it is data available it can give true otherwise it will give false if it is data is there it will give true otherwise it will give false now check it here is not required just we are using buffered reader java here is not required here is boolean is not required these two lines not important to but still we can use if it is data available it will give true otherwise it will give false yeah it is true data is available so we need to find out now okay how to find out to okay string i'm storing in one string when i'm writing string it should be kept string is equal to we are dot we are dot read line Mm. first while we are writing while loop while we are dot ready we are dot ready bracket means this is the loop so begin the bracket next is why is so control space yes so if it is data available it will print here we need to mention the extra bracket here save click on run so true data is available hi good morning i hate monday okay so directly we can uh, use file reader also we can get the data from any sources resources any external resources like uh, Mm, any resources like uh, uh, ja, uh, sorry ex, uh, text document to notepad or excel file ms document whatever you want you can give here so 
this is the concept of dynamic handling file system concept we can without going to d drive we can create new file in file system using code and we can write the data into the file system using code we can get the data from file system using code so that is the concept of dynamic handling file system concept dynamic handling file system concept we can create a new file in file system. Hmm. Hmm. ask me ma Sir, the BR dot ready and the how do we come to know that it is related to the Boolean and all that stuff? Ah, just to the, uh, this method. Ready is a method, madam. Ready is a method. Uh, see, well, this is the method. What so, if you and the return and the monkey? Where do we come to know? Sir? Yeah, uh, one second. If it is Boolean, Boolean is used for if it is data available or not, it will check. Okay. leave it second one is ready is a method sorry ready is a method it can uh, it will check data is available or not that is the method just we need to remember there is no alternate symbols and there is no uh, a plus b all square equal a square plus b square plus 2ab that is the principle we can remember ah ala sir sir ipudu ee method ki boolean return value ani where do we come to know antunna yes see na uh, wait wait Uh, boolean boolean and taking one variable x equal to okay now writing br reference br dot reference so compulsory go here it will show you method your boolean buffer reader method it is showing or not oh, okay okay mm -hmm. boolean return value okay br dot ready mm -hmm. so next so we are storing on one variable so we need to print s by s for control space x okay so it's very easy here is not mandatory boolean is here is not mandatory we don't want just we are using so we have scope here so in future we don't have any scope to use this boolean so that's the reason i'm using here here is not mandatory not important just for just i have boolean just we can check using this boolean we can find out if it is data available it will give true otherwise it will give false save click on run true hi good morning i hate monday this is the concept to dynamic handling file system concept using this file system concept we can create a new file in file system we can write the data into the file system we can get the data from file system that is the concept to dynamic handling file system concept okay yeah sai is it easy or not easy <laughs> and wish me madam ah uh, yeah yeah it's easy only but just wanted to know like we methods and we I mean, out of practice, we will come to know. Correct. Only so practice. I mean, all that I told you before class. Only I told you. Yeah, it is only practice oriented. Only practice oriented. Sir, sir, whenever you are writing file, you are importing only file Java Ivo statements only. If I import any other statements, no, it is only practice based. Okay. If you know, there are number of Java. Ah, uh, ah, ah. What is file? File. Whenever you are writing file, go see, madam. Your file, oh, this one I am deleting. Here, file. After keeping the cursor, it will show you number of option. Which one we need to choose? Java, Ivo. Have you know? Only practice oriented. No, there is an alternate. So compulsory, you should you should practice. Then only you can get it. That is the concept of dynamic handling file system. Throws, throws Ivo exception. Ka kunda. throws iwa exception kaakunda other options are also there right so ah, yes yes any other uh, other options is there whenever you are taking other options it will show error compulsory we need to take only iwa exception iwa iwa only iwa exceptions only so that is only based on practice only you can get it okay there is no alternate so what uh, what statements we need to import there is only practice only practice only you can get it okay that is today concept to okay sai you can go to office and tomorrow we have class 9 9 10 9 5 only 9 o'clock only okay just make it 9 o'clock okay 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 sir okay. okay i will send you this recorded file within 10 minutes why because it need to convert to uh, vlc vlc
uh, VLC format. So it will take 10 minutes only within 10 or not 10 minutes no, within 5 minutes. It will uh, convert into VLC format. Just give me 5 minutes within 5 minutes. I will send you a recorded file and just once practice it and tomorrow we have class India time 9 o'clock. Okay. Okay. You can I, send to okay, uh, team viewers. Uh, yeah. Uh, 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 through Skype I can send you. Or any okay. other. Uh, Google Drive. Yeah, yeah. You are yeah, sorry. Do one thing. Send me your uh, mail ID. Already I have Utpala Madam ID. Just tell me your mail ID. I can keep in Google Drive. Right? Okay. Uh, that is better, sir. That is better. Very, very better. Okay, madam. Mm -hmm. I will send mm -hmm. you now. You. Have a nice day. Take care. Tomorrow we have class in the time 9 a.m. Thank you. Oh. Thank you. Okay. Thank you. Okay. Bye. Bye.